For the last more than 20 years, I've been doing research in the areas of poverty and more recently, well actually for two decades, research on homelessness. Most recently, I've been looking into the issues around hidden homelessness. This has been a gap in knowledge around homelessness in Canada and internationally. Hidden homelessness is um, just like it sounds. It's something that is hidden, invisible to people who are researching homelessness or also to service providers, policymakers, and the general public. It involves forms of homelessness that um, involve things like couch surfing. Many people live in places that were not meant for human habitation. So they may be staying in an abandoned building, for example. That's sometimes also called squatting. We've interviewed people who were actually living on a porch or under a porch. Uh, things like this, uh, circumstances like that where others don't know, uh, necessarily don't know that they are there. Homelessness has been on the rise in recent years. Uh, there's more pressure on services. Shelters are often full to, um, to being overcrowded, in fact. Uh, there's great demand for food services like soup kitchens and food banks. So all of these are indicators that poverty is um, rising, homelessness is rising, and therefore, in order to plan, we need to have a, a reasonable understanding of how many people are affected. This year, uh, with a grant from the Social Sciences and Humanities Research Council, uh, a group of researchers at Laurentian University and University of Sudbury uh, were going to uh, conduct a project on a national scale to bring other researchers together to speak about what needs to be done, the concrete steps that need to be done in, in northern and rural places in order to address homelessness and, in, and also hidden homelessness. So we're going to have uh, a series of workshops in communities to bring people together to talk about this issue. Then we're going to have a national conference about it and finally produce a book. Um, and this is something that we don't have in Canada. We haven't had people coming together to really speak about hidden homelessness and how it's related to the issue of homelessness in general and what needs to be done to address it.